As soon as it's broken, flash. Yep. And peek. Why yep. are you running? Why are you running? That's right. I'd love to have him as a teammate. Yeah, he's good. Great comms and mental, to be honest. Hey guys, Joel's here. We're starting something new. We're giving away one free coaching session every week. Watch until the end of the video to find out how. Enjoy the video. What's up? What's good? Let's look at your tracker real quick. See what's popping over here. Oh, don't roast me too hard. So gold two last axe, silver this axe, silver three. I hit gold one for yeah. like one game mm -hmm. and then it's been down bad since. Oh, nasty loss streak, huh? Yeah. Oh, I see it. I see it in the history. Okay, so you're like a breach one trick. Okay, I love seeing that. Exactly what you should do, I, uh, to be honest. Just insta-lock breach. I okay, so 129 damage per round. KD 0.96, 18.9% headshot. Okay, decent headshot for silver. One percentage is good. So we are winning games. So we're, we're doing something right. It's like a healthy range to be in. All right. Yeah, let's go to mid, mid. I can, I can flash out, I flash out. Okay, good flash, good calm, good rotation. Things are looking good. You guys can actually run into B to be honest, but I love this space control actually. Don't care about anyone else but me. Oh, I dinked Rana, I dinked Rana. Ooh. Oh my god, nice. Nice, yeah. yeah. That was a good round by you, even even still. Like, I like the idea to rotate there to mid, and then as soon as you guys got B control, you started kind of taking space in that area, right? I like that a lot because there's a good chance that no one's going to be there, right? When you push right. up there. There was even an opportunity there to even flank, right? Like push yeah, through and then further, kind of flank. Yeah, yeah, exactly. That that that, okay. that could have been an option. By Spectre for or Bulldog, yeah, that's good. That's good. Yeah, I like Bulldog. The only issue with this is like, I usually prefer getting full armor. Yeah, uh, that's true. So you don't get stop. like one bang by like a sheriff or something. Tens. Ooh, shot. The hunt begins. Nice. Good job. Ooh, nice, nice, nice. I was a little bit worried there that we like we peeked a little bit too wide and kind of gave him a 1v1. Like I feel like if we yeah. had peeked that a little bit different, maybe she had that 1v1 and then could have killed you. So in that sense, I would probably like maybe play off my teammates there. Like I would just wait for Cypher to start shooting and then you swing. You know what I mean? Kind of okay. thing. Yeah, I got you. Yeah. Yeah. But other than that, chilling, dude. Nice round, nice shots. Yeah. And then we just hold? Nice. Uh, back here with me. Stunning. 30 seconds left. Okay, so here have a Cypher hold and then get ready to swing off of him. You know what I mean? Like on the bottom? Oh, or yeah. He just, or he just, that, or he just, he just does that. Off. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No, nice round. He makes it easy, huh? Yeah, ideally there, you know, it's like a 2v1. That's what you guys do, yeah. right? You guys just play together yeah, sure. and then it's like, it's actually just unlosable. Your decision making is good. Palms too. Good mental. Okay, that was a little risky. I think we, -door, we were juggling our utility a little bit. Someone break mid-door, my flash. Good calm. Good flash. Nice take job. Take Very good comms. Good decision making too. For this being silver, this is exactly how you should be playing Breach, by the way. Take notes, everyone. I like this. Yep. This is good. This is what I was talking about round one, right? I love the rap there, right? This this round yeah, we actually yeah, did it, right? Great. You got the timing, yeah. you, you caught him off guard. So it was good. I can flash you on a peek right now. Nice job. Great utility usage. Great comps too for the utility. You can probably take A. Ah, I couldn't probably be more proud. Off. I couldn't be more proud. Reloaded. You can tell they watch my videos. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> no, but seriously, like this is very now. this is very healthy approach to the game, I think. Last player standing. Oh, 1v2 situation. Has ult? You could even rip the ult, to be honest, because you yeah. heard him close. Yeah, yeah, I would do it. I would do it. Yeah, yeah. Oh, he mollies bomb, fine. though. It's fine. Push through it. Push through it. Yep. Got the spike. Not sure yeah, what Sage I, is. Yeah, she's probably... I don't know. She may have pushed up behind me. 30 seconds. Yeah. yeah. Dang, man. 
Let's try. Yeah, that's a it's a good like assumption to have, right? Because we didn't see the sage with the KO there. We could only assume yeah. that she was probably flanking in the back there. Yeah. What you could do is after you get the kill, you don't have to like do anything right away, right? It's not right. like you don't have to like react right away. Just kind of like think, hmm, you know, you know, just I think you had time to play with there that we could have just been like, all right, maybe we just go back C, we just walk back, you know what yeah. I mean? Like just take it a little bit slower after that first kill, but it was a good try. It was a very good try. Okay. okay. Have your flash out, yeah. As soon as it's broken, flash, yep, and peek, yep. Nice job. Yeah, that, that's, that's so broken. Yeah, it really is. A shot. This is like an easy way to just set up free kills, right? You just like flash yeah. like that. Yeah, yeah, that poor, that poor Neon. <laughs> <laughs> Stop, pause the video right now and go subscribe. Thanks. Jing, hold on. Flashing high as well. Yep. I'm just run it. He's gonna be close here. Yep. The shot. And I think last two were uh, Brookendor, yeah. Yeah. And Sage Resder. Ooh, top, top. Oh, uh, rotated. I don't want to let her push up on us. Here. I'd love to have him as a teammate. Yeah, he's good. Yeah, she's playing sight. She's playing sight. Great comms and mental, to be honest. Can you break door? Oh, yeah, I'll flash through. Yep. One more, one more. I would flash again. Flash again. I think she's yeah. close. Yeah. Oh. No. I think she was. She might have gone up here. Yeah, yeah. I like this play. I would. Yeah. Play back a little. Yeah. I don't see like that. Oh now. yeah. I would have talked in that corner. You know what I'm saying? Like the, yeah. the heaven corner. I think that would have been yeah. a good spot. Only yeah. because like to get the timing where you can get around, like and like get close to them, I think would have been unlikely. But. I would have gotten one and died instantly, or yeah. Yeah, or she would have just been looking at you, you know what I mean, when she comes around the corner. But I think if you tuck in heaven, they're not going to be ready for something like that. Yeah. For some reason, I usually like going, so you could either opt to go armor and then util, uh -huh. or ghost or util. One of the two, I think, it would be a priority, yeah. Yeah. Oh. oh, he had 10 yeah, HP. That is super lucky. Yeah, yeah. A chance to win free coaching every. I should clarify, it's a chance. You are not promised free coaching. <laughs> nice shots. Let me get. Uh, oh, nice try. <laughs> yeah. Nice round though, dude. Your utility usage is good, right? Like, it, I've noticed you have you have really good. Uh, usage of it. This one round with yeah the yeah. sage where I was like you have your ults yeah. yeah and I'm like dude you can you can rip it here because in my mind I'm like I heard one here for sure and yeah if definitely I heard, knew he was there yeah so you're just like you might as well gamble and hope both are and if they aren't then you, I would assume you had a good realization you're like I think he's waiting for me in the back but we started running there anyway when you have yeah. like 40 seconds to play with as soon as I get the bomb and I don't see the second one like I kill the KO and I don't see the sage I'm like what. The Sage isn't playing with the KO, immediately I'm like, this guy's flanking me. You know what I mean? Right. And I'm like, okay, so if he's flanking me, I have two options. I can walk back and take that fight, or I can just go into C and then take this, take the site, and then plan for back here and plan for myself. So taking it a little bit slower sometimes, like with kills, we can go slow. But with utility usage, you'd go fast. So what do I mean by that? Okay, so if you get a kill somewhere, like let's say I get a quick kill mid, um, and my teammates were grouped outside of A, and I'm like, all right, guys, come, come mid, right? Like, you don't have to force this right away, yeah. because what usually ends up happening is, like, if one person was playing Link, and they were going to take a fight here on A, but you kill the guy mid, he's going to rotate back here, and then this person C is going to rotate back here, and they're going to beat you to this rotation, and they're going to be ready for you, so... I feel like in, in a game like, I don't know if you've you played Counter-Strike or, or if you've heard of Counter-Strike before, but it, that's that's I've a game. Yeah, yeah. So in that game, it's kind of similar to, to Valorant, but in Counter-Strike, it's a lot harder for the defensive side to rotate. Like they don't have this sort of like luxury timing to rotate. Man. Their rotations are a lot longer. So when you get these like early picks, like if your team is grouped outside of A and then you get this kill on B and you're like, guys, guys, come back B, quick, quick, quick. Like in Counter-Strike, this would work because by the time they rotate back, you already have sight and your team gets sight before they can even make this rotation. But in Valorant, I think the defense rotations is too quick for you guys to make like these impulsive decisions off of one kill like that. What I would do is like after getting this kill, it's like, oh shoot, I got to kill mid and maybe I go C. 
Because in my mind, I'm yeah. like, well, maybe I pulled a C guy. You know what I mean? Because the guy B died, and he's going to be worried about. You know what I mean? Like, I can I can go slow, or I could be like, all right, guys, what do you guys want to do? We have numbers now. We can just group up and hit something. Like, basically, you can slow it down. And comms are good. I actually really really like your comms with your util. When you're like, I can flash you for you, Reyna, right? I'm flashing for you. Um, we can flash and go. These are, dude. These are very very good comms. Stun. You know, you're stunning. You're using your aftershock to clear stuff. Like, yeah. it, it's really good so sometimes i do notice like we will be like juggling like this where you're like a little indecisive and during uh -huh. this juggle period we can't shoot our gun so it's right. a bit scary got to be you got to be a little bit more you know careful with juggling like this if, if you don't know what you want to do yet i would just keep the gun out and then when you're just like yeah. okay i can flash boom flash and then pull out your gun back again you know what i mean so we, we just like basically limit the amount of times that we can get timing like while you're doing this and they just do some crazy peek like this and then timing you and kill you. Yeah. I'm like, oh, dude, that sucks. That's super annoying. I get right? triple peeked. Yeah, yeah. Comms are good. Mental great, dude. Like, good stuff. I love, I love, like, the sort of, you know, mental you have for the team, you know, trying to get them to talk. It's just very good habits to get into because this is how you win more games, right? So even looking at your stats, you might think your stats are dog but it's okay, it's fine. Your, your stats don't have to be perfect because I actually think you're gonna you're caring in other aspects that might not even like seem, um, you know, like that is important. But you're just like, well, I have right. a 57% win rate, but my stats are dark. Am I getting lucky? No, you're not. You're caring in other aspects that it's just not tangible. It's not tangible to statistics. It's like you have good mental. So it boosts up your team's mental, allowing them to play better, allowing them to frag better allowing you to win more right it's like right. that where do you see that on a tracker you know what i mean like you don't you don't see that and same with comms with your utility usage because you have good comms with your utility usage, you set up your team very well they perform better because of that they do well and it's like you know it, it leaves you to win more games so all of these little things they just start stacking up and it's great so one thing for sure it's like with the 57 percent win rate if you were to just keep doing what you're doing and just solo queue or not solo queue, i'm sorry but just keep spamming queue then you're gonna climb right like regardless of what you're going to get back to gold i'm actually surprised that you're even in silver or even gold like with how you calm and your decision making is very good guys 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 free coaching every week join the discord in the description box below if you want to try out other coaches go to coaching.joelcv.com or click the link in the description below they're already players, they're great people, and I personally vouch for them myself. Good luck climbing.